everyone. Today, I will guide you on how to perform IP adapter more accurately by using a very useful set of nodes that can project different angles from an original image, which also helps IP adapter apply better reference images. Here, I have used an example image like this cute dragon, which has given us different angles, respectively. Although it may not fully depict, with just one image, this node set can interpolate, which is quite surprising. For example, this image represents the top right angle. This image, on the other hand, represents the rear angle. This image depicts the rear completely. This image shows the rear left angle, and there are other angles as well. I will experiment with another image for you to visually compare. And very quickly, we have the result. Now, let's compare it with the original image. Here is the top angle again. Here is from right to left again. As for the third image, it's the upper rear side. You see, it's quite accurate. Some other angles also provide decent results. I have to admit that the creators of these nodes deserve recognition. There are many applications for this node set, as these images can generate a very beautiful or even unnecessary complete model. You can even use it for training if you can generate some nice or interesting images, such as characters, for instance. Now I will use these images to utilize the IP adapter, a very useful way to quickly and effectively sample references. I will use the encoded IP adapter, and the embedding node contains many different parameter images, which is very suitable for the images that have just been interpolated. I will use the IP adapter plus because this version offered better accuracy than previous versions. Now we will set up some steps to complete the generation process of sample. The first image has been seen. Perhaps I will need to adjust some parameters to get better results. and the result is gradually getting closer to the reference image. As we can see, her hat is beginning to show two ears similar to the reference. I just need to adjust a little more, and the result will be significantly better.
And now it's quite good, perhaps a bit more processing is needed. However, to save your time, I will upload this workflow to my Patreon channel so you can easily experiment with it. And if you want to know how this node set is installed, please go to the Comfui Manager. Then search for Stablazero. It's here. Just install it, restart, and begin your testing process. Good luck! By the way, if you find it interesting, please subscribe. I will release many techniques about Comfui as well as other eyes continuously. Thank you, and see you in the next video.